Four. Listen. A. Listen to a live news report and tick the events that happened. This is James Thompson live from Blackford, where it has been raining non-stop for the past 36 hours. Mr. Jenkins, a town council member, is here to inform us about the situation at the moment. This is the worst flood the town has experienced in the past 30 years. The damage cannot be described. And more importantly, there are about 300 residents in danger as we speak. That's a big number. I know. We had asked residents to evacuate their homes yesterday when the river began overflowing. Unfortunately, many of them decided to stay and are now trapped. I can see the rescue teams trying to help. They've got a tough job because all the roads are flooded. The amount of water is incredible. Three out of the four bridges have collapsed, so the rescue teams are using helicopters and boats. Thank you, Mr Jenkins. Oh, there's rescue team leader Robert Simpson. Mr Simpson, will you please tell us what your teams are doing? Well, there are rescue teams all over the town. We're evacuating all the old buildings first. You see, a few have collapsed and we're worried that more will fall. Do you mean we have deaths? Fortunately, we had evacuated the buildings before they collapsed. I'm sorry, but I have to get back to work. At the moment, we're evacuating the hospital. Thank you for your time. Uh, excuse me, miss. I see that you just got out of a boat. Where were you trapped? Oh, it's a long story. I live near the river. I was in my house when the water started coming in from everywhere. I can't swim, so I ran upstairs. But soon the water started coming up the stairs. Fortunately, one of the rescue teams heard me screaming, and here I am. You're very lucky.